The Minister of Interior, General Sheikh Rasha bin Abdullah Al Khalifa, received the first Deputy Prime Minister, Minister of Defense, and Minister of Interior of Kuwait, Sheikh Fahad Yusuf Saud al Sabah, upon his arrival to Bahrain, leading a high level security delegation. The interior minister and the Kuwaiti minister headed to the ministry's building where the guards of honor saluted them. Present were the deputy minister of interior, the chief of public security and a number of senior ministry officials. Then the official discussion session between the two sides began, during which General Sheikh Rashid welcomed Sheikh Fahad and the, and the delegation, hailing this visit, which reflects the depth of historic ties between the two countries, under the leadership of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and the Emir of Kuwait, His Highness Sheikh Mish'al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah. The Interior Minister noted that this visit comes at a delicate time for the region, which calls for continued coordination and cooperation to strengthen security and interdependence between the two brotherly countries. He praised the close cooperation in various fields of security work and the achievements of the Joint Security Committee, which was formed to activate the MOU signed between the two countries within the framework of joint efforts to enhance security and stability and unify positions in the face of current and future security challenges. They discussed a number of important security topics of mutual interest within the framework of enhancing cooperation and security work and building on what has been achieved to improve performance to face security challenges and rapid regional and international challenge changes. The Interior Minister then presented a commemorative gift to Sheikh Fahad. The Kuwaiti First Deputy Premier wrote a message in the visit register in which he expressed pleasure to visit the ministry and meet with the minister and discuss ways to enhance relations between the two countries to serve common interests and fulfill the aspirations of the leadership of the two brotherly peoples. He also expressed thanks for the warm reception and generous hospitality.